Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Can I change my immigration court date? If you're facing an immigration court hearing and need to change the date, you're not alone. Here's what you need to know. When you receive a notice to appear, NTA, it will specify the date and location of your immigration court hearing. This is usually the court closest to where you were apprehended. However, if this location is inconvenient for you, especially if you have family or friends in another part of the country, you might want to request a change of venue. To change the date of your immigration court hearing, you actually need to request a continuance, not a change of venue. A continuance is a request to reschedule the hearing to a later date. You need to file a motion for a continuance with the immigration judge. In your motion, you must explain why you need to reschedule the hearing. This could be due to a medical reason, a family emergency, or any other valid reason that shows you would face extreme hardship if you had to attend the currently scheduled hearing. You should attach any supporting documents like a doctor's note to your motion. You must also provide alternative dates that would work for you, although the judge is not obligated to grant one of these dates. It's important to follow all the procedural rules and deadlines set by the court. If you're not using an attorney, make sure to send a copy of the motion to the government attorney handling your case. The immigration judge has substantial discretion in deciding whether to grant your motion for a continuance. If the judge grants your request, they will likely reschedule the hearing for about a month after the original date. However, if the judge does not rule on your motion, you must still attend the originally scheduled hearing to avoid a removal order being issued in your absence. If you miss your hearing and a removal order is issued, you can try to reopen your case by filing a motion to reopen. But these motions are rarely granted. It's highly recommended to hire an attorney to help you with this process, as immigration law is complex. If you can't afford an attorney, many nonprofit organizations provide free or low-cost legal services. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Want the inside scoop on your neighborhood? Imagine knowing exactly what your neighbors paid or who actually owns that stunning house down the block. At countyoffice.org, you can create a free account and snoop through over 150 million property records, owner names, mortgage details, sale prices, all those things other sites make you pay for. Don't miss out on the fun. Just Google countyoffice.org property records or head to countyoffice.org directly and create your free account today. Go on, get your snoop on.